Has anyone ever noticed there's always that one person on the plane that never has to put their bag in the overhead locker or take it down? There's literally strangers that are going out of their way to make that person's life easier. Even the staff bending over backwards, making sure that they're very much looked after the whole flight. Can you think of anyone like that in your life where you would do absolutely anything for just to make them happy? What is it about them that makes you want to help them? Is it how skinny they are or aren't? Is it how beautiful they are or the kind of clothes that they wear? I'm sure that's kind of the last thing that comes to your mind when you think of them, right? Certain energy about them where they don't really have to say much or do much, their energy just speaks for them. Can you think of that person? Now the same pedestal that you just put that person on, I want you to put yourself firmly on that pedestal because you are enchanting and you are the type of person that makes anyone that you desire want to help you just to make you the happiest possible version of yourself. I actually saw a video recently of these kids being asked, what would you change about your body? And the answers varied from like, I would add a mermaid tail to absolutely nothing at all. I'm perfect. When was the last time you honestly looked in the mirror and said, I don't need to change anything about myself? Because that is exactly where I want to get you. That's where you deserve to be. And so an amazing way to start doing this is a sexual transmutation meditation on Breathe With Sandy's uh, YouTube. He's amazing. I couldn't advocate for him more. And this is a fabulous breathwork meditation because it's really taking all of that dormant sexual creative energy from your root chakra and transmuting it up to your crown chakra so you can embody that creative state so that you can know how powerful that you are and you really feel it because you're doing the breath work and you're taking the energy from your root chakra and taking it all the way up and you can feel it in that moment so try this for the next 30 days i would highly recommend this this is a great practice to start recognizing that you are enchanting and people want to do anything that you desire for you because that's just the type of person that you are. But the second thing that you can start doing that I've started doing recently is when you walk into a room, whether that's your living room, whether that's the gym, whether that's a restaurant, just quickly, carefully, gracefully scan around and I want you to begin sending love to everyone in that restaurant. This can take literally five seconds. It doesn't have to this big, this big drawn up thing, like walking into a restaurant and being like, I have arrived. Like we don't need to go there. It's just an energetic thing. You quickly, you know, go into your heart center, feel the activation and just imagine like a green mist emanating out to everybody in the room emanating out to everybody wherever you are and very quickly you're going to see that energy boomerang back to you this is how you become enchanting magnetic when you're not needing anything from anyone when you are literally a radiator not a drain you are not taking from the room you are giving abundantly because you are abundant you're completely limitless now say you want your partner that you're in a relationship with that you speak to every day that you see every day for you as an example to provide for you more spoil you more adore you more you may say instead of telling them to do those things you want to be quietly affirming to yourself he just loves spoiling me every single day he loves tending to all my needs he just adores the ground that i walk on you want to see him as if he is or she is the man woman of your dreams you want to see them through the eyes of love like they love to bend over backwards and make your life easier they just love doing it they're just obsessed with making you happy they just feel compelled to go and get you flowers they feel compelled to put you in your feminine energy or take care of you in that way because you're showing up through love through abundance just a limitless feeling of I don't need to tell you to get me this and do this right now. I just know that you will. Of course you will. You adore me. So if they're not showing up as you would prefer, you step back and ask, okay, who am I? What am I believing about myself right now where this would be allowed in my reality? If they don't take you out, if they show up to dinner in shorts and a t-shirt, if they 
you know, try and split the bill, whatever. You want to ask, okay, what am I believing about myself for this kind of treatment? Because queen, someone that's always treated like royalty, someone that's always taken care of, never, it doesn't really understand that kind of behavior because it's just not allowed. It just, it just wouldn't ever happen. It's like foreign. It's like me trying to speak French, right? Just no. So I just think you want to address your self-concept, but also do it in a loving way of like, of course, they love taking care of me. My world is always taking care of me. People love doing whatever I want them to do. They just love making me happy. And when you start to see people through these loving eyes and through these limitless abundant eyes, because it is abundant thinking that the world wants to make you happy, that the world wants to conform to you, that your world wants to give you whatever it is that you want. It's an abundant, lovely, beautiful feeling. When you start showing up in that way and showing up in uh, in circumstances that way, very quickly it's going to be reflected back to you. So I hope this video helped. And if you have got this far, for Black Friday, you can enjoy a huge discount on a monthly coaching plan where you will have your eight hour sleep affirmations, your personalized meditation, a mind movie inspired by Joe Dispenza and weekly coaching calls along with unlimited emails anytime. And we will be transforming your beliefs from the ground up so you can experience a complete transformation in literally 30 days. So you can check that out below. I'm so proud of you. You're worthy. You're loved. I love you. Thank you.